love box is rising back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time at my channel, much love and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing extended beautiful family, just thank you so much for the love and support. Being able to know that we can resonate with each other's pain as well as each other's happiness is so such a great blessing to me. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste. Love and blessings. Love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have been watching my channel for a while and have not already, please like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's about to upload her next video. And if you are comfortable enough, I would love for you just to drop a line or two. Even if, you know, I'm wanting to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or just up, tell me about your impact to give and how it impacted your life and hit you towards a positive direction. Also, if you feel like the video is giving you good vibes or good information that you would love to share with a loved one, family, or friend, please go ahead and do so. Um, even if it's, you know, a fellow impact or going through some really hard times right now and they need confirmation and validation towards their life path or even their life purpose. Um, and then while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit. And thank you once again for the love and support that you've been giving me. Is so greatly appreciated and i hope that you're able to resonate with the content of my video and today my um my meditation music is truly beautiful i used this like about a month ago uh it's called enhanced positive positive, ugh, positive energy 528 hertz miracle uh healing frequency music in uh enhanced self-love and relaxing music and i will post that link in in the description box below and my video today is about twin flame 101 hey Ocus, the secret to having it all is knowing that you already have it yes it's just the laws of attraction you know you're like oh i don't have money i don't have money to do this i don't have this to do that we always have to like manifest on it you know you have to like even with your affirmations you have to put it in there like as a past tense like i already have these things i have to you know i'm already already have this you have to always you know never question like i told y'all the other day never put can but put how you know it just depends on how you're speaking towards yourself how you're you know you're speaking towards uh the universe on the things that you're trying to manifest towards your life knowing that everything that you have you know you're you know you're you're reaching for you already have you have to be able to make sure you put that in your mindset and i'm learning that as i go as well you know and it's a beautiful thing because it's just like you know you know things are resonating with you and this is why i tell people when you uh second guess you know you know like i said ego negative people anything when you are trying to question never question your faith and i've i had issues like that as well you know, when you know you're manifesting things or it's on its way to your life, you'll start seeing signs around you left and right. Signs of you left and right. Like if you're trying hard to, you know, want to manifest it on you and your husband having a baby. Now, next thing you know, you start seeing it on social media. People are talking about their pregnancy or just having a, a new baby or, you know, somebody had a grandbaby. Or you're starting to see like the clear blue, blue easy commercials or you even see an advertisement about it or you'll hear people talking about it this in passing these are the things that you know gives you the signs to let you know these type of things are on its way to you and you just have to have faith in the patience and lord i'm a taurus <laughs> It is hard to have that. I have to practice on patience. That is the worst thing. But it's just like, you have to be careful what you're asking for as well. Because if you're asking for patience, they will put you in situations to where you have nothing but to do but be, be patient. Knowing things are coming your way, you just have to have faith as well. You you know, you, you pray to the universe, Lord, please give me faith. Give me the strength to get through it. They will put you in situations where it will give your strength a power boost. They will give your faith power boost you have to just you know keep working at it don't give up you know like i tell you i have to tell myself every day if you know you're working hard for it universe needs to see that you're working hard for it and everything even though if you might keep running into a brick wall they want to see if you can get back up and go over that wall just to go, go through another brick wall then they're going to say you know what they have not gave up yet and they're still going it can might be a, a couple months it might even be a couple weeks you never know but you keep working at what you're wanting in your life. You you keep working at it, doing affirmations, 
uh, you know, keep believing in faith, paying attention to the signs around you, you know, keeping things to yourself as well. I had to tell myself that you have to keep things to yourself because a lot of people are pray against the things that you want because they don't want to see you have that, you know, and there's times where you can truly think that you're having a, a decent conversation with people and you just don't know. They'll be praying, make, you know, be trying to act like, oh yeah, I support you and supporting to secretly hate your butt so you just keep certain you gotta keep those things to yourself you know you, you can't be on a mission and being able to tell somebody your next steps because they'll make sure that don't happen for you so and i had to learn that out the hard way as well you know because it's just like times i've been wanting to really talk to somebody there are certain things you have to take to god in the universe before you take it to somebody else because god is gonna make sure you have it you know but you keep going you start paying attention to the signs around you. You keep working hard. Don't think that it's going to come easily to you. It's not going to fall in your lap. And you can't just sit up here and say, God, I want this. And not sit there and try to work for it. It's not going to happen. It is not going to happen. Um, I keep doing the things that I do. You know, I always, there's certain things I'm trying to aim for. And I have to keep working for it. You know, things that I do. You know, I keep making Videos. This might be something I want to switch off and do something later, you know, and I love what I do. It's just like while I'm at it, you know, they're telling me to go ahead and work on these videos and I'll see where, you know, still working on my stuff behind the scenes or whatever, you know, just go ahead and do that, you know, and I, I just love, like I said, I love what I do, you know, being able to go through a situation, being able to see, okay, you know, I, like I told y'all before, I, I asked God, why am I going through this? Why am I hurting so much? Why can't this pain go away? You know, and then when you can step back without putting, you know, your situation with emotions, you can really see the reason why you had to go through these things. Your pain gives you purpose. Your pain shows purpose. You know, it lets you know, you know, when you feel like things are thrown up in your path to break you, it's like universal put you in a certain situation to say you never be broken you just had to go it's a trial and error you had to go through but knowing that what you want in life the secrets of knowing what you want in life you always got to make sure you, you say i have that i have that you know and you keep doing what you need to do and knowing you know it's gonna happen for you when you least expect it you know so keep praying up you know keep manifesting keep meditating stay in your affirmations make sure you say i am or anything that is going to basically psych yourself into saying that because it's like the more you keep saying that you have this, the more you'll start seeing all the different signs that, you know, this is heading towards your way. So you keep doing what you're doing. You know, don't give up. You know, like I said, universe will put you in certain situations to see if you truly want this. And if you truly want this, you might run into brick walls. You might have setbacks, mistakes, failures. That's okay. Because when they see that you truly have not gave up on the things you really want in your life, that, that's when the things are going to get blessed for you. So I hope you are able to, you know, resonate with this one. Sorry to mess so short. But, you know, everything is the way it is. So uh, my doorbell is ringing, so I will pause for the call. Sorry for the pause for the call. Someone was at my door. But, yeah, you know, trust and believe that everything is going to happen to you and everything is happening for a reason. Um, the situations that, you know, the minor setbacks, you know, the failures, you, you having to, you know, scrape your knee and get back up. It's all a way of life. But, you know, keep working hard. Having faith in yourself is in the universe that you work hard for the things that you want in your life. And tell yourself you already have these things. So when you keep saying that, you will manifest them more. And then also being grateful. So every little thing that comes in your life, you know, thank God and, you know, thank universe that these are coming. Because, you know, the show of gratitude speeds up things a lot faster. So I will see you on my next video. Let me give my post notification shout out to... Um, Stacy Folly, uh, Empath Caliber Inc., Crazy Living, Olali Pete, uh, underscore one. I hope you know I'm trying to say that name. Y'all need to give me a different name that I can pronounce. And Lauren367, I mean 376, much love to you as well. Like and subscribe, hit that notification bell, drop me a line, share, give me a thumbs up as well. And, you know, like I said, like and subscribe, give me a shout out. You, I mean, you drop me a line, I'll give you a shout out on my next video. So I hope y'all have a blessed, safe week. The week is almost, yeah, it's, all, it's hump day. So I almost forgot what day it was. So, you know, I hope y'all have a blessed, safe week. And I hope everything is, you know, well, you know, 
and know that you are truly blessed, highly favored, forever loved, and knowing I'm always out here praying for your better days. And make sure you send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. You never know, your kind words can really go a long way for someone. Much love to you. Peace and be wise.